The following is a fan-based discussion. All properties discussed are property of Toei Inc., Bandai, Hasbro, and Subarai Productions. Hey everybody, welcome to the TokuCast. Before we get the review started, we just had a quick little shout out. Uh, as of recording this, it is uh, the birthday of one of our oldest fans, one of our oldest followers, Colin Williams. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Birthday happy. Happy birthday. Now on to the review. Bye guys. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the TokuCast Reviews Guy Muff. Try. I wish it was Gaim. No, I want to go back to Gaim. It's Gaim month, everybody. We're back to Gaim. I wish yeah. you were in X8. That's fair. Drive <laughs> month. We're going to actually finish off drive month here. We're not going to split this up into another video. Because we want to be over with. Sort of. These movies, unlike the X8 ones, which we're going to end up doing, don't really do much for the actual plot. They just kind of blend together. Sort of. So we're going to start off with the Lupin one. We're, this is going to be super fast. Don't we do, do the Lupin one already? This is a different Lupin one. All oh, right. Yeah, because Lupin comes back in this movie after you, you think it's him, but it's actually another Roy Muto that he took over. And Lupin comes back. They end up fighting the bad. It's it's a movie. It exists. That's it. I yeah. really had nothing to say about this movie. Yeah. <laughs> it's a movie. It exists. Moving on. Yeah. Chaser. Woo. The lady who ends up playing the angel Roy Muto was Shizuka oh. from Bokinger, the evil ninja lady. Start up. Um, this is also when we get gold chase. It looks atrocious. It's not the most atrocious thing. No. We're getting to that. It's not great. But I'm sitting here just looking at this thing like, wow, it's gold now. Woo. Gold seems to be a big thing in this show. I mean, look at Wizard. <laughs> Look at uh, Gold sorry. Infinity Dragon. Gord Drive. What is it with Japan and L and not being able to do L's and R's properly? It's the way that the language actually works, but in this case, for some reason, they completely just messed up the translation. <laughs> it's like you would think that one person around you wouldn't know how to translate key to gold. Next. This movie is not great either. It's, it's it's not the worst one. No, we're getting there. We're gonna do the Maha one first before we get to the worst one. Okay, Maha, Maha. Go get the girlfriend. I'm done. <laughs> I'm just... He's trying to bring back Chase still, and he gets a girlfriend, and you're just like, I really wish this was you in the G4 movies. <laughs> well, at the end of GP and the G4 movies where you just kept dying over and over again. Yeah, that'd be fun. That, that was a fun time. Next. Hold on, because there is something here that we actually do have to talk about. Not Chaser Mock. This is Mock Chaser. Dumb and stupid. It's just the Kit Bosch again from the end of the show. But this time, it's Teal. Or is it Sky Blue? Either way, it's trash. Yes. <laughs> It's not great. It's still not the worst. We're getting there. I like the color of blue that they use. Yeah, it's a good it's color. Like I just shirt. don't know if it. Yeah, I just don't know if it works with the rest of the outfit. No, because the purple, purple, red, and blue together don't do well. It. It's like you have to. It can, just not like that. I think it depends on how much you have of each. Yeah. I think if you have purple as the primary, and then like red and blue as accents, or red is the primary, and then purple, purple and blue is, but just, blue cannot be the primary. No, unless it's get. dark. Maybe if it's navy or something closer to black. Maybe it. Yeah, it's just contrasting brightnesses. Like the. Uh, I wish I was wearing it. The one hundred shirt. Yeah, sir. One hundred shirt. Yep. Deca Master. The one hundred shirt from Deca Master. Yep. Deca Master. That's how. That's how that works. Yeah, no, it does. But also, it had the benefit of black in it. Yeah. And black goes with everything. Almost everything. I was about to say, uh, not... Mostly everything. Yeah, I was, I was... For some reason, my head went to brown. It can work. Uh, it depends on shades. It, yeah, again. But... White goes with everything. The, the, the Maha movie, again, exists. It's a sequel, yeah, but it's just like... Uh, Do we care? No... Didn't think so. The last one, though. Technically, there's another one, but we're not going to talk about it until Ghost. Oh, yeah. Um, But the next one. Ma uh, Mock accidentally brings back Hart because he was sleepy when he was trying to bring back Chase. And also Brain and Medic at the same time. 
you can tell how enthusiastic I am about this whole thing. It's it's a bad setup. There's this weird kit bosh form they get in this too, where it's a uh, type wild technique and type speed at one time, and it looks atrocious, Barbara. Don't blame this on Barbara. She can nothing to do with this monstrosity. I will blame this on Barbara, aka Trixie Mattel's new album that comes out in two weeks. Go get it. But it's still not the worst looking suit. Uh, Kamen Rider Heart is Nightmare Fuel. <laughs> Someone designed that, sketched it up, took it to Toei, and Toei went, you have, yes. No, no. Someone designed it, sketched it up, and they said, you have type try try to run to work with. Go off of that. Because the base suit is just try to run. Is just try to run. And it's the most atrocious thing I have ever seen in common. I feel like Oh, uh, yeah, that was also awful. Um, it's type Miracle. I f- wasn't this on our worst Kamen Rider yes, Suits was. list? Wasn't it the top? It was up there. Because this is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. It's the cape? It's the horns. The horns, because they had to keep Heart. Heart's horns there, and they don't look good. None of it looks good. This movie is not that good either. No, none of these movies are good. But that's par for the course at this point. I'm just numb to it. The problem with Drive is just like, they couldn't really figure out exactly where to place a lot of this stuff. And a lot of it ends up being super inconsequential. When we get, and that's sort of the problem that they have with the Gaim ones as well in some cases. When we get to X8 though, everything really leads into everything else. And they're really specific spots where they're set at in the story. That's fair. But it's just like with the rest of the dry ones, why we just decided to add them all in the one video. I would here. rather have seven more demo movies than have these again. Ah, oh, I tried to forget those. But it's still better than this shit that we are given. Yeah. Which is unfortunate because I like Drive. I really like Drive. I liked it so much more on first watch. That is fair. <laughs> now, here we are. I like Drive more because I know what's coming after it. <laughs> like even on the second watch I kept going it's not worse than what's next Amazon season 2 because that is the next comrade we're doing well you know what I meant I meant the act the main writer that came next he was the main one either way not great um what we're going to end up doing next is Garo season 1 oh the anime of oh, the anime cool and then after that uh, it'd be Jacob and I doing Ultraman Max we and I get a break then after that, Shattered Grid. Oh, we're do- man, we are postponing the bad shit as far as possible, aren't we? I had no idea what you're talking about, good sir. So, stay tuned for that. We'll see you in two weeks for Girl Season 1. And don't forget to join us in all the things. All the things. Do not watch these movies, though. Never. Yeah, I, I would suggest hard like, skip. Hard skip. Hard pass. <laughs> yep. But we'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody. Bye.